good morning guys out here at Tomahawk MX. Today I'm riding my Supercross track. So we're gonna test this Skydio drone out on the Supercross track and um, we're gonna see how well it can follow me. I know the other video I was just kind of roaming around and going in circles and there's a couple settings I didn't try yet. So we'll see. I'm gonna try a couple different settings. I'm gonna ride a Supercross track at pace. Even though the track is uh, completely frozen right now and gonna be probably a slow pace, at least you guys will have an idea how this thing can follow me around a track. Today is also my last day riding before I head to the first Supercross race of the season. So wish me luck. I hope to see you guys there. I think they're allowing fans. I don't know. You would think as a racer we'd have some information, but I don't. Um, I think they're having fans. If they are, um, come say hi in the pits. If they let you in the pits, I don't know. And enjoy my drone footage. Hopefully I don't crash it. I don't have the dog here today, so I can't crash it into my dog. So that's good news. Um, we're just going to give this thing a test run. We'll see.
too shabby, honestly. Um, it seems like the more I figure out what setting to use and what scenario, the, the better the footage comes out. If you guys watched that last clip, it easily followed me for that lap with no hiccups whatsoever. Super fun, again, super excited to see what this thing can do. And ready to go racing. So I catch a flight tomorrow, and uh, yeah, first race in Houston. A little nervous, should be fun. Um, my goals, it, I've been getting asked this a lot, my goal is to simply manage expectations. And what I mean by that is, I think in the past, whether I was super prepared or not prepared at all, um, I would put really high expectations on myself. My goals would be result-based. So when you ask a racer a lot of times, what's your goal for this event? What's your goal for this season? They'll give you a number, right? Oh, I want to win. I want to be 10th place. <clears throat> so if you don't reach that result, it feels like you failed. For me this year, my goals are have fun, which sounds silly, but that can be hard to do sometimes. Having fun has a lot to do with being in the moment, not worrying about the next five minutes, the next day, the next week, just being in the moment and enjoying it. I race Supercross for a living, that's pretty darn awesome. So I wanna be able to truly be in the moment and enjoy it this year. My other big goal is to simply impress some people, whether that's myself, whether that's the team, whether that's you know other riders, and I just want kind of the old AJ to come out and, and show himself every once in a while and just impress people that way and have what I envision is the reaction of like, oh, okay, AJ's back. Like that's, that's kind of my goal. Not worried about results. If I ride how my true self can ride, I'll be happy with it and I'll leave the race with that fulfillment. And that's really all I'm looking for. Um, so I think that's good advice for you guys too. In the future, possibly, you know, Goals don't always have to be an, a number. They don't have to be, I gotta win, I gotta get third, I have to get 15th, it doesn't, that can be completely irrelevant. That makes you worry too much about the future rather than being in that present moment. Super excited, next video you guys will see will be filmed by my film guy Cameron and uh, we'll be at the races, so crazy, crazy excited for all the content we're gonna be bringing you guys from the races, from the classes during the week, everything, Cam will be doing all of it, so video quality will be way better than what I produce for you guys, and yeah, I'm pumped. Make sure you guys subscribe if you haven't already. Um, thank you to everyone that has. We're at 50,000 by the time this comes out, and I think I said that last video, but we've been slowly creeping there. I, we should be at 50,000 now, so thank you guys for helping me reach that milestone, very exciting. By the end of Supercross, let's try to get this thing to 100K, that'd be pretty unreal. That's one of my goals for this season as well, is get this YouTube to 100,000 subscribers. That would be an awesome milestone to hit. I'll see you guys at the races. Thank you for watching, and see you next video.